Hi there, this is Armand Plumbing Dues performing a sewer inspection properly located at 5019 South Butlong Avenue, Los Angeles, California, 90037. Today is June 24th, approximately 12.30 p.m. Here we are, we scoped the sewer mainland road cleanup located on the right side of the property. We made it all the way out to the city line. Uh, the view we have right now is the actual city line, the water flowing through. We're going to retract. Uh, this is the saddle. Saddle is a connection between a house sewer line into the city line. Uh, the saddle over here is broken, as you can see. We have tree roots on the right side, and then we have a broken clay piping on the left side. Uh, there we go. Uh, retract further back. I have a better view right here. As you can see, separation and break in the actual clay uh, transition piece right there. That's the saddle. And as we retract, you can see the offsets. Uh, all throughout the six inch clay, we do have offsets and we do have tree roots ha that have came through. Recommend check the record to see when it was the line hydrogen in the past to establish some sort of a, a timeline. It is highly recommended to perform another sewer inspection a year from today, just to confirm uh, the growth of these roots. As of right now, the growth of these roots are not too aggressive, uh, they're not causing any uh, restrictions in the flow, no clogs, in other words. But however, these roots will grow bigger. Uh, the bigger they grow, the harder it will become to actually clear with the cheddar. Uh, it is highly recommended to maintain it, uh, depending on the growth, uh, every six months to a year, possible every other year to hydrojet. Uh, chopping these roots when they're barely growing is always a better option than when they're fully grown and hard to cut. The more time you spend with the jetting on these clay pipes, the more damage could cause into the clay pipes. However, the saddle, the connection over there, uh, there is absolutely uh, no jetting that could help. Uh, the pipe is broken. Uh, no liner can fix that. We'll have to physically excavate the street and replace. And here we are. This is the connection between the plastic and clay piping. So we do have an all new ABS plastic that line that runs from the back of the property all the way to the sidewalk area. This area right here is a sidewalk where we have the connection between ABS plastic and clay piping 4 inch to 6 inch. And here we are, as you can see, we do have a negative slope or what we call it a belly in the new ABS plastic sewer line where it con continuously holds water. The amount of water that is being held is approximately about a 1 inch, 1 inch of an uh, a belly what we have in the line. Uh, eventually these areas could cause uh, um, clogs and then also it could cause uh, bad orders coming through the fixtures in the house due to standing water in a pipe. Other than that the newer ABS pipe looks in a pretty good condition. So the best course of action for continuing replacement of the actual sewer main line which is the parkway and the street public works picking up where the sagging in the ABS plastic is and then replacing the new six inch all the way through the city connection that'll be a, a, a good course of action recommend check the records and permits and warranties on all the new sewer pipe that has been installed over here. Thank you for reviewing. This will conclude our sewer inspection at this property. Clean up located on the ground near backyard fence. And that's the side of the house leading to the street where the sewer line runs to. Thank you for viewing.